Hey guys, it's Ben with Taylor Tackle here. We're fishing in mid-September. Um, pond that's got smallmouth and largemouth in it. We're fishing a, a deep rock pile that we're hoping to catch some of the some of the last fish that are hanging out here, feeding up for for when they push shallow for winter. We're using the Taylor Tackle uh, jig with a brown the brown grub that comes in the Taylor Tackle kit. Perfect little crawfish imitation, even perch and bluegills will imitate. Uh, hopefully there's some fish out here that want to eat it. There it is. Just like that. Dragging it through the rocks. Nice small mouth jumps up and eats it. This feels like a good fish. So these fish, I guess this is one of the last ones out there. Oh, it's a largemouth. So scratch everything we said about smallmouth. It's a nice thing about throwing a jig. You never know what you're gonna catch. You know, this largemouth is sitting in 20 feet of water, but that jig will catch anything. That's the beauty of it. Nice little two pound largemouth. We'll take those all day. a seven foot medium heavy bait caster. It's perfect for, oh, I got a blade. As I was saying, it's perfect for any species that you're fishing for. We're fishing for smallmouth and largemouth today. You got plenty of backbone to haul in. I'm guessing this is a largemouth, the way it's staying down. 14 pound monofilament. Good drag. It's a good rod for anybody. Oh yeah, big large now. Come on over here, girl. You wanna come in? Look at that. Taylor tackle jig right in the face. Perfect little combo for catching these fat fall largemouth. Let's get this guy back and see if there's any more down there. I'd like to catch a smallmouth if they're mixed in with these guys. 